In this video, I'll show you how to navigate the OH portal and how to complete the consultation task. When you first log in, you can see the dashboard. This shows you how many tasks are outstanding. They are split into groups, so you can use each link as a shortcut to the filtered list. For example, clicking on Overdue Tasks will take you to the Tasks page showing only the overdue tasks. Here on the Tasks page, you can navigate to Due, Overdue or All Tasks using the links in the top menu. If you have lots of open tasks, you can choose to show more records on the same page by changing the number in this drop-down menu. You can reorder the tasks using the little arrows at the top of each column. You can also filter the tasks using a search term. This could be anything from an employee or company name to task owner or task type. For example, to view all consultation tasks, you can type in consultation, but make sure you have the correct filter chosen at the top because otherwise you may only see due or overdue tasks and not those that are due in the future. When the admin team scheduled an appointment, it will appear in your task list. The due date is set to the date of the assessment. You can review the referral details by clicking on the employee name. Here you can see a summary of personal and case details. You can also see all the supporting documentation that has been added by the referrer here in the Case Details section. The Clinical Notes section shows any notes left by members of the clinical team. These notes are not visible to administrators or the customers. To view the full referral form, just click on the View Referral button. It will open in a new tab. To return to the Case File page, just close this tab. After the appointment has taken place, you should return to the portal to confirm the outcome. You can either click on the consultation link in the case details section on the case file or access this form directly from the main page using the buttons on the far right. You have three options here, consultation completed, DNA or rescheduled. If the appointment is rescheduled before it falls within the late cancellation bracket, your administrators will make the changes for you, so you should not need to use this rescheduled option here. When you choose Consultation Completed, it will create the next task for you, which is to prepare the management report. If you choose DNA, then the case will be assigned back to the admin team.